Hello friends, uh, I'm Charles and today I will show you again how to plant uh, roses from seed. You see most of the people, okay, it is, it is from country to country. Now some people try and uh, they, they it is not so sex successful. Others try it and they are successful. So I will show you now how to do, how to how I, I plant my roses. Some people use a uh, hybridized uh, peroxide and they uh, put uh, it in between the uh, piece of toilet paper or uh, something, uh, soft paper or so, of a soft cloth and they put it between them and throw, uh, put it in the bag and uh, put it in the, in the fridge, freezer for a few months or a few weeks for the rose seed to, to germinate, yeah, that's a, to, to germinate and after it germinate they plant it in a, a bucket or whatever you see you want but I will show you now the way I work and uh, from I start from 2016, 2017, 18, 19, 20 and 21 and every year I am successful in planting rose from seeds so I will show you now what I do. You can try it. If it works for you, it's fine. If it doesn't work for you, it's okay. You can try again. Some people in some countries they use, uh, they put it because it is not so hot. Because now it's a hot season now. It is no summer in, in uh, our countries. And uh, now the ground dry very fast. Uh, so you must put, and as other people use uh, that uh, greenhouses and they plant their, their uh, pl uh, uh, they plant their seed in the greenhouse and uh, they are successful that, that way they did, they did but I will show you now from start to finish what I do and what will work for me maybe it can work for you also some, some people they work stay in places uh, countries it's very snow snowing snow so you must find a, 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 a more better warmer place to try to germinate your plant, so you must have uh, something like a greenhouse. But something some people use a light, uh, ultraviolet lights, my red lights, and they try it with it. But okay, I will show you now the way I do it. You can try it. I never put my seed in the deep freeze. In the fridge, I never do it. I plant my seeds in direct in the, in the ground. I use a. Uh, the plants, you see the plants on, uh, around your house or so, you put your seed in that plants, see, in the ground, on the, in, the, in that plants, the ground, and you, every time you water the plant, so you water the seed also. So that is, that is the way your plant cannot be dry out because when the plant is, is fine, the rose seeds will find, and, and after a few months, some is a little bit quicker, some a little bit longer, but after a few months you see, yeah, is my, my rose, my small little rose. So I will show you now what I do, and you can try it. Okay, it's up to you. But uh, what I also told you, you who don't have to, who don't have subscribe yet to my channel, please to subscribe, man. Of uh, ring the bell or so, and uh, I will show you videos from all of my work. So you can try it again, and you can do it yourself. Okay, let's let's start with the process. The child's small process. Okay. Here is a seed, uh, a hip, a rose hip. And this one was from uh, my, one of my new, uh, my latest uh, roses. And this is also a seed, a, uh, a rose from seeds. You see there. So there's a hip. And what to do? I will, I will cut the, re uh, the hip. See, I pray. Okay, there. See, there's the hip. So I will open the hip and I will show you the seeds inside and I will show you how to plant it a very quick way. So what you can see here is also a, a rose, a pink rose from, that was on, also a seed rose from seed and there's a, there's a new rose. But I will go, go now to the other side and I will show you the best way to do it. 
Okay, there is uh, another one. You can see and it is this a yellow, yellow or orange. You can see and I will open this one and show you how to plant it to have near roses. Okay, so I will open this rose now and I will uh, remove the seeds and I will put it in a small plant bucket, you can see here. So it's not so difficult, just try it this way and it will help. So I will take my knife and I will make a slit inside. See there? And you remove the seeds. See? And see there? That is the seeds. It is a hot one and so on and so on. Remove it like that. It's not so difficult, it looks difficult, but it's not so difficult. This is a very easy task, task you see there. There can be 240 seeds in one, in one heap. See the heap is that side, that one. You see this? The orange, that is a heap. And the seed is inside. See? And there is your seed. 5, 6, 2, 4, 6, 8, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20. So you can see that is more than 30 seeds there. This is more than 30 seeds. But sometimes, most of the time, it's maybe 5 or 4 or or 20 or so grow, uh, uh, come out and the others die. So that is alright, that is fine. So what you must remember after you, before you plant, your, your open your hip, you must clean your, your knife with warm water or, this, or something, you see there, you must clean it. Because there is uh, a lot of germs, you can sit on that and you can kill that that rose seeds you can see. So you must clean your knife after and before and after you do your work. As you can see, here is a a, a order with seed in with young plants inside. So that is also also for the demonstration. And I will put the the seed in that open spaces here. And after you put it inside, you take your uh, every, anything with a, a flat surface or so, you see here, and I push it in the ground. See there, I push it in the ground. Not too deep. Not too deep. Just when the, the ground cover that that uh, sweet seed, you can see there. Yeah. So it. Or you can throw a, a little bit of sand over it, just to make sure. All the seeds are covered. See there? Then throw a little bit of water on, and that is it. See there? Okay, I wet this ground already tomorrow, but I will soon do it again to see, let you see. 
Oké, okay, zo zo zit is dit. En je kunt springen of je kunt zo smaller worden aan het. Niet zo wat. Een hele robot. En de uh, every day uh, when you throw your water on that plant here, yeah, you also throw water on the seeds and you leave it. You leave it. You can even uh, make a a a, 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 a dateless when you plant it. See there how much how long it took to open whatever kind. See so this is it. Okay, friend. Now my plant, uh, my seed, a plant, and I, I leave it there. But I will go now to the other other side, and I show you my new roses from this year. You can see how big. Or how small the new plants are. As you can see here, is my here are my new roses. Look here. You can see here. And that is even right to plant now. Here's one. You can see, yes. And that's I plant in this in this year. So you all you want to do is every time when you with your plant, see yes we plants. Here's my plants. Every time you water your plant, you see water that roses too. And I even knew of those roses because in winter, and during winter we don't we don't uh, wet our plants. And uh, after I see there's a small mango tree. Look here, it's a small mango tree. And there's my roses from the seeds. So when it did look like grass, you must understand there's something wrong, that that is not roses. You can see there, the rose look like this, you see, it is a tree leaflets, and when it grew up and uh, for bigger roses, it has a five leaflets, so that is all the leaflet, you see it's one, two, three leaves on, oh, one, two, three, one, two, three, but when it grew further, there come another two leaves, and that is two, four, five. That's it. So friends, this is it what I will give you. And try, you don't have to use a uh, hybridized uh, uh, peroxide and so on. You can plant it directly in the ground, and you can germinate it in the ground, and that is it. Okay friends, so that is it. And you don't have to try any other method and so that is the fastest method to plant your roses. Do it like this, put in the ground, forget about the rose. I, I exactly, exactly talk about people stay in winter growing, uh, winter time countries like where the rain and so on and the rose, rose, rose uh, right? plant it there and leave it there and after two, three months or when the is over, and you must be begin to water your plants, then you will see there is your small little rose plant. So thank you very much for all the subscribers. Can everyone who try to plant it and make use of my methods or his own methods? And thank you to hear your what is in your mind with other people. So friend, that is it. And uh, it's now Friday, but because tomorrow we have a a special uh, event done. So friends, thank, thank you for all. Don't forget to subscribe, ask questions. I see you in my next video and God bless you. Bye bye.